Hello everyone, it's the Upform team over here and today we're just going to show you guys how you can start exporting Qualtrics surveys out of the Qualtrics database. Now, something that you might need to know about before doing this is that the way that Qualtrics works is that when it comes to exporting their surveys, they usually do this through a QSF or as they call it, Qualtrics survey format. So the Qualtrics survey format can basically act as a backup or a means of transferring a copy of your survey to, let's say, another Qualtrics account or, in this case, any account that might also be associated with Qualtrics on your team. Another way that's provided by Qualtrics is to export your forms or surveys on the website into a Word document, but just note that unlike a QSF or Qualtrics survey formatted file, Words doc Word documents cannot be imported back into the Qualtrics database. So QSF files work, but Word documents don't, but you can export into either options through Qualtrics. Okay, so let's just get into the specifics of this. We're gonna show you guys how to export your survey as, first off, let's start with the Qualtrics survey formatted file. So first things first, you're going to first want to navigate to the file that you wanna export. In this case, we're gonna export the cafe file we have here on hold. Okay, so now that it's open, all we have to do is first open this tools button, which should be beside the saved notification over here, somewhere located a little bit off to your left from the center top area. Let's just hit tools. And then from here, you're gonna see that one of the options here is to export or import the survey. So if you were to print the survey, this would basically export it as whatever file you might want to have it as. So you can have it as a PDF, which is also an option. Just note, obviously, like the Word file, you cannot transfer this back into Qualtrics. It would only be as a PDF and that's it. Next, we can also export the survey as a QSF file, which would then appear here. If you were to open it, it wouldn't really work unless you were opening it on Qualtrics, but we're gonna show you that in a different video on how to import QSF files. And lastly, you can also export it into Word, which is the last option down here. So if you just click this. Okay, so here you have a lot of options when it comes to exporting to Word. You can show the question numbers, logic, show the coded values, strip HTML tags from all question answers, Condense drop down choices, show survey flow, include graphic. Now these are really important features to take note of and to really mess around with depending on what you need because unlike the PDF we saw a while ago, which shows you what the form would look like as if you were the one answering the form. So basically the preview version, if you look at the Word file, so let's just export it without changing anything. So you guys get a better idea of how this looks. Okay, so as you can see, it doesn't actually appear as the same way. So literally you'll see the pages are kind of separated in this case because it's taking account of other HTML codings and the like. Each option is kind of separated into their own page. It basically doesn't appear as it typically would if you were not to make any of the correct choices on that previous page. Okay, and that's all we really have to say about this. Hopefully this helps you better manage any data collection you might be doing. Thank you so much for watching our videos. Be sure to like and subscribe. If you need any more help when it comes to Qualtrics, be sure to check out the rest of our channel using either the link on the upper right corner of this video or any of the links below. See you next time.